so uh, you're just getting started in arena you don't got a lot of rares you don't got a lot of mythics this deck's going to be great for you don't get carried away i know you're looking right now and you see a benelish marshal and you see the citywide bust and you see the history of benalia breathe easy we got some answers for that in the sideboard let's get this thing started First up, we're going to run two charges. This is a really janky deck, guys. I'm just going to call it Whitey, or Jank Weenie, one of the two. Creatures you control get plus one, plus one until end of turn. Very simple and basic card. I mean, but it can help out in certain predicaments. Actually, one of those will unfold uh, throughout gameplay. So stick around. Four Dauntless Bodyguards. It can protect something, but also it has two one for one, and it's a knight. Not bad. Four copies. Four copies Knight of Grace, because Knight of Grace is just an amazing knight. It's got First Strike and Hexproof from Black, so it's going to be a little more difficult for your opponents to remove. And also, Knight of Grace gets plus one, plus zero, as long as any player controls a black permanent. Pretty cool card. Four copies, Silverbeak Griffin. Why? Because it's flying, and we're running Mono White. We can easily get this sucker in the sky, and uh, our opponent's most likely going to want to target it before a few other things. Benelish Marshall. Benelish Marshall. It is a three drop. Other creatures you control get plus one, plus one. If you are completely on a budget and you're running Arena, you're going to want to try to get at least one or two copies of this in your deck for this deck to really be a success. Uh, we're going to run four copies of it. Citywide Bust. Destroy all creatures with toughness four or greater. That's right, because we're not running big creatures. I think one creature in the whole deck is big, and I have slots in the sideboard which you can swap in and out cards. Three copies Citywide Bust. Four copies History of Benalia. Yep, I got another answer for this card as well. It's in the sideboard. A Johnny, Adversary of Tyrants. That is a nasty cat right there. I underestimated the power of this card, to be honest, but one copy, if you can afford it, go for it. This is a must. Four copies of Conclave Tribunal. You, you have to have this card in the deck. You just have to. It's got Convoke, so that means we can tap other creatures and to pay the casting cost. When Conclave Tribunal enters the battlefield, we're going to exile target nine land permanent opponent controls, basically dealing with any threat on the board. Four copies. Four copies of Inspired Charge. Amazing card. Creatures you control get plus two, plus one until end of turn. This is what finishes out games. You will see that throughout the playtesting. We're going to go into Competitive Constructed, so it's best of three. And I'm going to run two of those back-to-back, -back and we'll see how we do. Venerated Loxodon. Four of these. It's got Convoke. When Venerated Loxodon enters the battlefield, put a plus one, plus one counter on each creature that convoked it. Pretty neat card. 22 planes. That's the whole kit and caboodle right there. Sideboard now. Let's say some of these cards you just can't deal with <clears throat> or can't afford. Seal Away is a great option. Um, if you don't have f four copies of... Uh, maybe you don't have Citywide Bust or something like that. You don't have a bunch of copies of Citywide Bust. Or you don't have your uh, Conclave Tribunals all the way up. But you do have some seal ways you can sub those in. Also, Dub. Dub is going to allow uh, a Silverbeak Griffin to become a Knight. So then it becomes a 4-4 Flyer uh, with First Strike. That's pretty nasty. Then we have four Radiant Destinies. Yeah, if you have them, great. Throw them in. Another way to substitute stuff for Benelish Marshall. So we're going to have four of those in the deck. Call the Cavalry. We're going to run four Call the Cavalrys. Create two 2-2 two, two White Knight Creature Tokens with Vigilance. This card you can easily substitute for your History of Benalia if you really have to. If you can get one or two copies of History of Benalia, by all means go for it. If not, Call the Cavalry is awaiting you. It's a common in Dominaria. Easy to get your hands on. Two copies Leonin War Leader because that's just nasty. Maybe you don't have um, a bunch of the uh, Venerated Loxodons. That's fine. Throw in some Leonin War Leaders. It'll act great. Plus, it's creating two 1-1 one, one white creature tokens with lifelink. That's just nasty. Light of the Legion. Maybe you just don't have any of the bigger creatures, right? but you have a Light of the Legion. Throw it in the deck. When Light of the Legion dies, put a plus one, plus one counter on each white creature you control. That is the deck. It works well on a budget if you're in Arena. By all means, try it out, but let's get into that gameplay. Make sure you smash that like button. It helps out a lot. Let's do this. Competitive janky play versus 
shard at night. Shard at nine. Ooh, not terrible. Not quick, but not terrible. I like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Too bad we got no turn two play. Maybe we'll draw into a knight. That'd be cool. Opponent scribe. Of course. No, we're coming at him fast, so maybe that'll help. We'll see. Good old Gargari. Net deck net deck specialty. I just did a deck on this the other day. Turn two, unfortunately, we're gonna have nothing to play. Opponent's putting me to sleep. Dropping the Merfolk Branch Walker. Congratulations, Sonny. Be nice if we can get on curve with a two drop. Ah, oh, it does not happen. Brutal. Probably shouldn't have done that. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. We'll get some damage squeaked in. No turn two, which is really hurtful. Looks like he hasn't got a land. That's cool. Maybe. Maybe not. Just wait until the end of the turn. There it is. Wish a rejuvenator. Okay. I get it, bro. The old Golgari, eh? All right. We will go into... Benalia. No attack. Now, we're not coming off too strong yet, which is kind of poopy. Kind of sha-poopy. All right, we'll get rid of that quick with our conclave. We've got two of them. Came out the door pretty slow here. Yeah, I'm just not going to entertain that. Pretty cool. We really need some friggin' land here, that'd be nice. Opponent's gonna drop two life. Surveil. It's like they have to do it. They just have to do it. Do it again. Yeah, just the one. We'll swing in for our two two. Hopefully that was the entirety of his deck. Maybe that's all he's doing. Maybe that was it. His whole plan is just to get up to his demon, Doom Whisper, and that was it. I think so. Oh boy. We're going to have to counterplay that as well. I need a land. Can I just get a land? That'd be sweet. Bloody blemas.
There we go. And we're going to take out his liquor. Gimme. Oh, you know what? I should attack with him as well. That's okay. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. That was... Uh, I, I made a mistake. I was thinking they had first strike. It, my bad. That was my bad. Terrible play there. Should have got him for... He should be at uh, 8 right now. Opponent's at one, 1 card in the end, which is a plus. That's not really going to help him. I think we go Benalia into a Benelish. Corner takes out. That's good. But he did that instead of taking out Benelish or Venerated over here. So he has no cards in hand right now. That's a plus. Good. We can trap two cards at once here. So we can smack our History of Benalia down with our Gauntless Bodyguard. Probably go into another History of Benalia after this. Really, we should. No attack. No attack. No attack. So another Benalia and then Benelish to wrap things up. And that should give us a really big push when we do attack. Unless the opponent has like a Ritual of Soot. I mean, that should really close out the game. We'll see. Night of Grace. Decisions. I go. I could go this. Yeah, and then venerate a loxodon. That's better. And then we can venerate the next turn. Bada bing, skadoosh, skadoosh. I like that. You like that? I like that a lot. No attack. And then next turn, we should be able to just close it out with Benelish. Got him. All right. That worked out. Luckily, our opponent didn't have too much crazy removal and counter spells and all types of wacky stuff, so we were able to win that one. No sideboard. You know why? Because we keep it gangster around here. Straight thugging. All right? And now I'm over here. We just moved. Do you like me on this side better? Oh, what, what, what? We got to keep that. Pretty slow. Man, stuff like that can help out, though. We're going to hang on to that. It really it wasn't the best move in the world. Goodbye, Conclave. I'll miss you. Now we got our worthless charge. Pretty cool. It's not entirely worthless. It does something. Plus one, plus one guys. You ever heard of that? Now we got two of them. Well, isn't that a hoot? So Knight of Grace smacks the field. Got our deuce deuce. Hexproof against black. He can deal with that. Great card to run because everyone's running black. A lot of people are at least. A lot of people are at least. The, the, the Pezzle. Benelish Marshall. Good card. Hopefully we keep it around for a little bit. That'd be nice. It'll swing in. If he blocks with elves, I would have Oh, okay. All right. All right. Opponent's at 15. Whoa, boy. Can't do much about that. He's going to destroy something. Oh, no. Before I make you disappear. Oh, he's going to take out the Benelish Marshal. Oh, gosh. Oh, that, that's not... Oh, this is not looking good. Oh, boy. This is not looking good. Um... We're coming for you, Vraska. We're coming for you. That's it. I'm going to drop another creature. 
Maybe we can charge it and kill it off first strike type stuff. No, I'm saying. Can I sacrifice a land? I wonder if he feels he has to. Oh my gosh! He is crazy. Alright, staying alive, staying alive. Locks it on. Not helping. Man, we are in some hurt right now. So we gotta attack. And here's where our little charge comes in. <laughs> That's all we got. Skipping. <laughs> we didn't lose him. That's a plus. And he's winding down on cards. I've always got four. One's a forest. You like me better on this side? I think I like me better on this side. Kill off another land. Maybe he doesn't have anything more than four casting in his deck. I don't know. Possibility, though. He does have a land sitting in his hand. We need a land right now. That'd be sweet. Not a land. Silver back. We are going to. We want to kill this thing off, man. We really do. We just don't got enough to do it yet. Could add one more to it. No, we'll just do that for now. Because he couldn't kill something anyway next turn. Bottom wing. That got my attention. That got her attention at least. Wake up. Grab a brush. Put on a little bit of makeup. Oh, got me flyer. Only has two cards in hand. They're not lands. Another line of war. Maybe not. Sacrificing an another land. I think I, I I don't think I played a deck like this yet. I don't think I have. Man, talk about not getting the best hand though, huh? Need something big. Can we get a land. A land would be cool. I mean, that's something, I guess. He's got a couple threats now. Pink. And I can get my Venerator Loxodon out next turn, if I so chose to. How about a land, though? That'd be cool. Oh, give me that land. Thank you. Appreciate you. Thanks for coming out. This guy loves sacrificing stuff. Sometimes sacrifice. He's probably in a cult. Oh, he drops the lane of war. Alright, we got that land that we needed. Ah, oh, cool. I think we're going to do it like this. We're just going to double pin. We'll have to block one. If he doesn't, sweet. Okay, so he's going to block that, and then this is where we charge. A little perk. Bam. Now we're going to take out his queen already. Goodbye. Nice. Nothing else we can do, unfortunately. But we do have an inspired charge. And a venerated Loxodon chilling, chilling about. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. Venerated Loxodon, plus one, plus one. All my homies in the house. Splash him up. Bam. Now we got a little bigger, and then next turn, get a little bigger. Still got that Conclave, that's huge. So any like, big thready drops, we can take care of it. All right, we are going to, I mean, why not? I mean, we'll see ya. Uh, he's not, blo he can't block, okay. Let's just pump it up now then, whatever. Shkink, shkink, shkink. Game. Not bad, not bad. We will take that. So it's a janky deck. Um, I, I kind of think we were up against a somewhat janky deck as well. Uh, but we did, we were able to pull the trigger on that one and won it. So that's, that's pretty good. Um, appreciate it. Love you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Punch that like button on your way out. Great way to support the channel. Also, it lets you know uh, it'll pop up in your feed. That's what the like button does. Makes my videos more seeable for you. Welcome to the Jank Bank.
Can we make a miracle happen? One way to find out. Net deckers are everywhere. It's not terrible, but we don't have a lot of our one drops and whatnot. We'll keep it, but I don't think it's uh that makes that smart. It's nice to get our one drops out. Daemonic hordes. Eighty degrees. And then we'll drop our Benelish. Probably history of Benelia first and Benelish. That surveil ability is pretty strong. And then draw a card. I mean, it really is good. The old Griffin Flyer, huh? Get Sister Benelia. Next turn we got Benelish, and then after that Inspired Charge, that could win the game if our opponent allows it. <laughs> hmm. Oh, it's got Death Touch. Whoops. That was dumb. Whoops. That might just cost us the game, actually. Well, not cost us it, but we could have won in a sweeter fashion. Oh, Banish Marshall. Goodbye. Brutal. Totally messed that one up. Next turn, we should be able to win it. Good board wipe right now. And then we're sitting with an inspired charge and nothing to do. But if he did that, the hostage... Oh, I can cast the hostage. Never mind. That's not, uh, that does help him a little bit, I guess. Except for when we inspired charge. Ooh. Almost enough to cast them both. All attack. Then we'll smack Inspired Charge down. When he goes to block. And we should get a Conceit out of him. He's not net decking. That's a plus. Doesn't matter to me, but whatever. Good game, sir. Benelish. If he can't kill it, we win with Benelish. Got a bit ahead of myself there. He needs to kill Silverbeak. Oh, that's it. If he has an instant, he's going to get that flyer out. Mm, I see, I see. Down to 11. Cool card. That doesn't kill it. Oh, toughness for a greater. Yeah. Let's do that. I think I'll cast this first. Hopefully he counters that, and then we drop citywide. He chose not to. There's a little bird out. And I'm assuming he has an instant or a sorcery right now in hand. And that's all she blew.
game, you rap bastard. Alright, on to the next one. Here we go. Demo Demonic. Let's go, Demonic. Them counters are gonna wreck us, though. Goes to the Dauntless Bodyguard. Pass turn. He had to add a bunch of removal, I'm assuming. Squeak in for two. I'm gonna sack it now. No, I wouldn't sack it now. Cool. You end the turn. Citywide so bus not looking too great right now. <laughs> Took it all. Take that. Like a champ. Opponent's at eight. Got him. All right. So the deck worked out a bit better that time. Demonic hordes. Round twenty. Fight. Up against a quick little aggressive white wiener deck. See what we can accomplish. We'll keep it, but we gotta get lucky with a land. We got lucky with a land, cool. Coming at our opponent fast. Another land. Griffin, countered, no countered, wow. Into Benalia, and Inspired Charge, into game? Maybe. Oh, he's ready to counter stuff right now. Good news is we can deal four damage every turn with or without Benalia. So we can get a little bigger there. All attack. Opponent takes out our with bodyguard. We'll deal two damage. Squeak, squeak. Oof. I kind of want to go Benelish right now before history. I guess I'd rather have him block or take out Benelish and take out history. Deal with that. Attack for noise. Opponent to twelve. He hasn't really done much, but destroy a creature, counter a creature. No creatures laid down. Okay, that kind of hurts. Guess another history of Benalia. Swinging in. Opponent is at eight. Next turn we can seal it if he doesn't do anything about it. Okay. That's game. Got him. Not bad. Rough start though. Rough start. We'll take that one home. Janky for the win, baby. Janky. Punch the like button, guys. Means a lot. PLA.